So guys, unfortunately, I have some bad news. We lost another friend, and this one happened when I was AFK. <sighs> I feel really bad about it. Where a goat's gone. No, where a goat? Oh God. So here's what happened, right? I was AFK, just kind of, you know, in my in my base. Um, we have turrets now, by the way. I'll talk about that in a second. I was like probably right around here, okay? And uh, you know, we had we had all three of our little shoulder pets out here. We had uh, I want to be Winston from the island. We had Reginald the Eighth from Scorched, and we had uh, I thought you were about to come in here. That would be rude as it's all hell, man. You stay out of here. Vermin. Um, and then we had Weregoat. We had Weregoat in here too, right? Okay. So somehow a Dillo got in here and killed Weregoat, but didn't kill anything else. Didn't kill me. I don't even understand what happened because I came back and I was like, you know, everything's normal. I didn't really, I didn't expect anything, right? And then I remember I saw a Dillo run by and I was like, oh, you know, that's kind of weird. I'm going to go ahead and shoot that. And it, I shot it and it was dead over here. I have a photo of it. And um, and then, I don't know, a few minutes later, I was like, huh, this is kind of weird. Where's Weregoat? And then I looked at the tribe log and there's a picture of it. Weregoat's dead, killed by the Dillo, the same one that I killed. I don't even understand how it happened and like I didn't get killed I didn't even get damaged like I was probably standing like right here I still don't even understand how any of that happened um but yeah the Dello decided I guess to come in kill Weregoat and then leave without doing anything else so uh, apparently I it was a targeted it was a targeted attack I'm getting so emotional he came in and just targeted him didn't you know he didn't do anything to him I don't even understand <laughs> So where goat's dead? Um, that was really unfortunate. You know, I didn't expect that to happen. So I went ahead and put, I want to be Winston and uh, Reginald into cryopods. And now they're in cryopods. My fridge is over here now, I forgot. Um, so yeah, it kind of sucks. But I also, you know, we gotta, we gotta think about this. We gotta think about the safety of our creatures. So I went ahead and put up three tech turrets and they are only targeting specific creatures that would generally be in this kind of area and would attack my creatures. So pretty much all herbivores are off the list. I don't want it shooting a Bronto and the Bronto just be slapping my creatures all over the place. That would be horrible. But um, yeah, if anything comes in here, it's just going to die. So yeah, I thought we'd start off this episode with that, uh, with that horrible message, unfortunately. <laughs> Anyway, guys, we got some stuff to do here today. We gotta move on. Where goat wouldn't want us to be dwelling to be dwelling on this. I can't even speak now today. I'm just so choked up. Um, so yeah, we we got some stuff to do. I want to go ahead and start hatching up some Rex eggs. We've already got like just absolutely crap tons of them here. So we have enough, obviously, to hatch up a few, but also to level them up a ton as well. So I feel like you know what? Let's go ahead and just hatch up maybe four or five right now. Um, let's put this. Like right there. Yeah, that's fine for the moment. All right. So yeah, guys, did I, I feel like I already mentioned it. Maybe I didn't. Did I mention it? Either way, uh, go ahead and hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. Really does help me out. I do appreciate it. Uh, the 305s are the ones that we're looking for. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, let me see. Let me get you. So anything less than 305 does not have all the mutations on that. So... Uh, right here, this one here is good. It just doesn't have all the colors. Um, I need a male because, unfortunately, I brought over a female. So I need a male in this female's place. And then what I could do is I can go ahead and have these two breed together, get a crap ton of females, and have that one male breed with a crap ton of females. And then we can go ahead and obviously get a, uh, a good supply of eggs going at all times. So... Yeah, um, these are the stats that they pop out with, of course, as you guys seen before, like uh, 30 mutations. They're all stacked properly, so I can't remember what the, what the original stat was. You know what? I'm dumb. We can just check it out right here. So this was the original health, and that was the original melee, and now uh, with all of the mutations that we got last year, we managed to get the health up to this and the melee up to that. So uh, definitely like a good boost in stats. 
Bear in mind that this thing is also not imprinted, so that's an extra boost on top. And then all of the levels, so... You know what? They're not absolutely the most OP things ever. As I said before, I probably could have gone higher with the mutations, but um, I was happy with 30. 30 is a good number. Um, anyway, so we're going to go ahead and raise up a few Rexes here, and um, I feel like... Hmm... I almost kind of feel like taking on one of the bosses here today, but I don't know if I have enough stuff for that. Maybe we'll do that soon. Maybe not today. We'll do that in uh, maybe in the next episode or something. Maybe we can take on like the Desert Titan boss because I feel like we probably have enough Wyverns. I've got like three clones of uh, Flare, so that's definitely enough. And then I've also got Flare, so we could probably go ahead and, uh, you know, just bring all three clones and have Flare as a backup in my pocket or whatever. So. Yeah, we'll probably do that maybe in the next episode. I just, here, here's exactly what I have for the Desert Titan fight. So, um, I have enough to fight it three times with these two. Um, and I have all of the Sarko skins that I have. Thank you guys for telling me other locations where you can find Sarkos on this map. Uh, really did appreciate that one. So we managed to get the 40 Sarko skins. Need five more of these to be able to fight it three times and then tame it. And then uh, to fight it three times, I'm going to need 300 hearts. So I'm going to need like another 80 of those. Uh, here is an update on the Forest Titan. Still need to kill a couple more sauropods, but they're pretty much everywhere. And then here is the um, the Ice Titan. And then let me show you just some of the other ones here. So I've already gotten the Venom and then we've got that. I've got uh, 10 teeth in this one, 12 Venom. We need 20 for this, I do believe, right? Yeah. And then up here, we have 11 hearts so far, and then the three leftover teeth, and we need seven more of those. The Rexes have honestly just been the easiest thing to find, by the way, because, like, um, I don't know. They're just, like, always up in that area. It's great. So, yeah, really, really great spot to be going for them. Um, they do spawn elsewhere as well, but uh, I've always had really good luck up there. So I think, yeah, we're going to go ahead and start um, raising these guys up. Uh, do I have food for them? You know what? They're probably going to start eating out of the trough in a few minutes apparently cool all right so um oh by the way i've made a couple more uh things around the place so i have a teleporter now uh did we already have the transmitter in the last episode i feel like we might have and oh let me show you inside of here i've got um i made myself a tech rec saddle and i made myself a shield so obviously we're going to be using the shield at some point when we're doing the red drop, I would imagine. I feel like using the shield on the red drop just because I feel like I'm not going to be able to protect it very well um, by myself. I don't know. Maybe we don't need it for that, but I, I have one anyway. Um, and then obviously we have just tons of shards. I want to start cloning some stuff here pretty soon. Um, but we actually have tons of element. Let me show you. I've already used a good bit, but we have a huge amount left. And where we're getting this is from the element veins. Now, I crafted a chainsaw because I thought that you could use a chainsaw on the, the little node things when you, when you defeat it. And you actually get to harvest up all the element. Well, you actually don't. I didn't actually even know that. Um, so, yeah, that sucks. Uh, people have been telling me that the best tool is the pick. So, I started using that a little bit um and started like obviously stopped using the hatchet so much because i was using that pretty much all the time on them uh i gotta change oh i did not mean to do that i gotta change it to alphabetical there we go give me all of my stuff back sweet all right well yeah we're gonna go ahead and raise up some rexes and then maybe we'll take on a red drop here today that could be a good good idea yeah we might we might try a red drop and we'll use that shield just to see so, yeah, we'll be back in a little bit. Maybe I'll try to get, like, 10 Rexes. So, I got a couple more to hatch. Okay, so we just got a new mutation. This is awesome. Uh, so, now they're going to be 307s. Um, this one here has an extra melee mutation, which I'm so happy about. I mean, if I'm going to get an extra mutation, it may as well be on something that's useful. So, I guess we're going to chuck this one in. Well, we're going to get a male version of that and chuck that into the mix. So I guess that one back there is not really needed anymore. Um, yeah, this is amazing. I honestly did not expect to get this, so I'm super happy. Uh, so now it's 15 uh, health. Oh, that's not how you do it. I already had caps on, apparently. And 16 melee. Nice. So 31 stacked mutations. That is fantastic. Let me just check. Yeah, okay. So it's, yeah, it's, it's clean. Uh, for a second there, I was thinking, hmm, this better be right. But uh, yeah, we're perfect nice all right well oh you're apparently there we go no did i i thought i already did that apparently i didn't okay cool well um yeah so i've just been obviously hatching up a couple rexes here and then i got that i figured why do we keep like 
Oh god, I'm getting stuck on that tail. That's what it was. What the hell's happening? I, am I like lagged into the tail and it's like messing with me? I think so. Um, so yeah, I don't know. That's just amazing. I'm really happy about that. So I figured I'd bring you guys back just to give you that little bit of an update. And Giga, you can eat all these babies. All right, so we got a red drop very close to our base here. Uh, unfortunately, I've already taken all the creatures and put them into cryopods. And now I gotta drop them all out of cryopods and wait for them all to wake up. Unfortunately, I have the cryo sickness thing because I run my servers on PvP instead of PvE, which means that I can't get rid of that. <laughs> Great. Um, <laughs> so that's that's fine. You know what? It's it's okay. It's fine. It's it's gonna be okay. We are fine here. Let's just go ahead and, and dump them all out. There's no point of like bothering. We might as well just dump them all out at the same time. <laughs> Oh, this sucks. You know what? I'm probably not going to actually have every single one of them out, but I really don't want to wait like five minutes between, so we can wait for them to wake up. It's probably not even going to take that long. Let's go with uh, five of them at the start. All right, here we go. Five Rexes heading in on this drop. This should be okay. I mean, I don't, I don't know. We might end up failing this, but it's okay because if we lose the Rexes, we're not really losing anything, right? I just got to come back here and grab my stuff and grab this tech saddle so we're not really losing anything nothing major anyway the rexes do a crap ton of damage by the way and they're not even that leveled to be honest i could probably get some more levels into them really easily but uh, i just fed them a certain amount of eggs to get them up to a certain level so we could get this going all right let's pop our shield like there is that gonna be okay unpowered wait oh there we go i was about to say oh all right, for a second there, I got very concerned because I did check it before I left. And I was like, oh, okay, yeah, it doesn't it doesn't need like a generator or anything. It could just run off by itself. But obviously I have a generator in my base. So luckily I have some um, element on me. <laughs> oh my God, that could have been so bad. Oh no, I didn't want to make you roar. I wanted to mount. There we go. All right, so for the moment, I think we're just gonna leave these boys right here. They should be all on passive right now. Um, so we have that shield obviously protecting the drop. We hopefully aren't gonna have any of our creatures biting at the drop, but it could easily happen. Uh, all these rexes are the same, by the way. Uh, not really much of a... Oh my god, where is it getting attacked from? I don't even... Over there? Where the hell did that thing come from? All right, you know what? It's fine. Because I never really liked the outer shield anyway. It looks stupid stupid and red and, and stupid um it's fine i mean to be honest it makes it a little bit easier if that goes away because then i don't have to like run around so much oh wow that's a that's a high level creature <laughs> level 212 okay um yeah okay that's a level 212 all right so yeah my rexes are pretty strong um obviously with the mate boost and everything it's gonna make them even better uh, it'd be great if i had some uteranuses i'm not sure if we're really gonna get any i mean we could probably go for some at some point there we go that's me with mate boost right there but uh yeah i don't i don't know if i necessarily why what did i just do to that what why did i just do 84 damage to that somehow okay um yeah i'm not i'm not sure if we're like actually gonna go for uteranuses at some point i don't really know if it fits in with my plans and everything we might end up doing it we'll see what are you doing? These things just don't want to even attack me. They just want that shield, man. They really do. They're going to attack me now? Yeah, there we go. Okay. I was, I was kind of getting a little bit worried there. I was thinking maybe, you know, I'm not pretty enough or something. I don't really understand. I mean, they're being kind of a little bit, uh, you know, they're discriminating against my, uh, my arc character and my Rexes. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Come on. All right. Maybe I should get the Rexes. Okay. Yeah. Okay, boys, get in there. Start killing. Start killing everything. Okay, maybe come over here, though. There you go. Give me that sweet, sweet mate boost. Oh, it's delicious. I love it. I really do. Okay, here we go. Um, let me turn around on some of these spinos here. Okay, I'm going to get over there and help out because uh, there's a lot of creatures. Oh, my God. All right. Let's kill these two Paraceratheriums. What we, why am I doing like a weird amount of damage to him? Okay. Come on, buddy. Wow, this thing must be a super high level. Okay. 
where are the other Rexes? Okay, well, there's one. The other one's over there. He's trying to eat like a Tronodon or something. Okay, let's go on the Stego, boys. The Stego is giving me the stink eye. Oh, you know what? This is actually probably like a super good spot to have this, actually. Because um, we've got the little cliff right there, and that means that creatures aren't going to come from that side. Uh, doesn't look like the Tyranodons are actually even hitting anything. I'm going to just have them over there doing their thing. And I'm going to fight this one. Oh, my God. Yes. All right, what do we have over there? Let's just let's send the Rexes in. If I can get them to go over there. Can you like, there we go. Oh, oh, hello. I forgot about you. I forgot you guys exist. Uh Oh, that's gonna, that's gonna hurt. That is seriously gonna hurt. I wish I had noticed that on its way because I probably could have shot at it with the tech saddle. Okay, my boys are doing some work. We're getting, we're getting there. Gotta watch out for this fire because it's seriously hurting. Okay, we might have to pop open the tech saddle here in a second and use that. Yeah, my boys are doing some work. We're good. We're good. And I'm covering this whole side by myself. Okay. Come on. Oh, there's Dimorphs. Oh, did they? I don't think they hit the rider. I'm pretty sure that they don't hit the rider as corrupted ones. Okay. Come on, boys. So this is round three, technically. So not too bad. Come on. This Rex is like a super high level. There we go. 290. Holy crap. Okay. Let me go ahead and drop some some stuff. And drop in a piece of element. And let's go ahead and try to take out some of these wyverns. Because they are super annoying. Uh. Nope. Keep missing. Okay. That might not be better than just biting at them. There we go. That worked. Oh, nice. We should have enough, um... We should have enough talons after all this to take on the uh, Desert Titan. Sweet. Yeah, this is definitely going to help out. Oh, my God. Come on. Oh, let's take out the Wyvern. What are you guys doing? Take it out. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't think his fire can reach the center. At least I'm, I'm pretty sure it can't. I really hope it can. Can it? It might. <laughs> oh, my God. It's been a while since I've done one of these, so... You know, obviously my newbiness is, is showing. I know. There we go. My God, that was like a level 300. Okay. Let me grab out all the goodies. Bringing some bullets from my long neck definitely would have been a great idea because then I could easily snipe at this thing. I'm going to have to like sniper shotgun at it. There we go. Sweet. It's finally dead. No, 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 no. Let's not do that. Okay. So we've got a good amount of apex drops so far. Uh, we've got 23 hearts, a bunch of spino sails. Uh, yeah, we're, we're doing pretty good. I don't really need anything else. I don't need any more Rex arms, so I'm gonna just obviously be ignoring those things as they come in. Um, is there seriously another creature somewhere? I thought that was the last one. Where the hell's the last creature? Hello, little Darwolf. Level 5. Uh, yeah, I'm not exactly sure where this imaginary last creature is, but apparently something is here. Okay. Interesting. I guess we'll wait. <laughs> oh my god, this is stupid. Alright, well yeah, I guess we just gotta wait here for this imaginary invisible last creature to disappear. I think I just heard it pop. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Uh, let's get all of my boys over here. All of them. That's including you. You're part of this. Oh crap. Okay. Okay, you know what? You know what? Just do your own thing. They, oh. Wrong button. There we go. Neutral. Okay. I gotta go over there and deal with that. <laughs> Let's see if I can uh, tech gun at it. Yeah, this is a little bit better than getting set on fire. Okay. I ran out of element. I do have more, but... My boy's attacking? Okay, you know what? Seriously? Okay, wait. Okay. Uh, there we go. Never mind. Um, Alright, Spino's dead. Hello, Wyvern. Please. Ease, easy does it there with the with the fire breath. I don't really like that. You know I'm not a big fan of that fire breath. Okay, let's go over here and deal with some of these guys. Oh, those fire Wyverns are so annoying. They're like everywhere as well. There's so many of them. 
Uh, oh my god, I've got so many things in here. Uh, let's just drop in the rest of the element. How high do I have to shoot to hit you? <laughs> okay. You know what? Maybe I might be able to hit this one. My god, I hate the tech saddle so much. Okay, you know what? It's fine. Let's just deal with the, uh, the big guys over here. Okay, come on. There you go. Oh, yeah. Let's take down this fire wyvern as well. There we go. Lovely. Uh, okay, we'll deal with that one later. The good part is, is that they can't, they don't seem to be able to do anything when there's a shield there. They're just kind of like dumb, I guess. So that's, that's nice. Oh my God. I think that the fire can still hurt it. If they spray it, it can go through the shield. No, no. Are you kidding me? Wait, no, there's freaking meteors coming down. Isn't there? Oh my God. This better not kill me. Oh, it's totally going to. This is totally going to kill me. There's totally going to be a meteor that hits directly where I am. Just because, you know, Ark hates me and, and whatnot. I do so much for this game. Not, re not really. You know, I play it all the time. But that's about it. It shouldn't, do, it shouldn't be doing these things to me. Did my game just crash? Okay, no, we're good. What the hell just happened there? I'm not even sure. Um, God damn it. Why does it have to be a freaking meteor shower right now? Look at this. This is crazy. Oh my God. How the hell do I hit? Okay, am I hitting him? I think I'm kind of hitting him. Not very much though. Oh my God. We're, we're going to get hit. There's nothing I can do. Like I want to do this red drop and if I leave, it's going to go away. So I have to continue. Wait, how hurt is everything? Okay, that's pretty good. Shield's looking kind of rough, but we're okay. All right, you boys stay here. Let's get everybody onto neutral. Hopefully this does not turn into a disaster. Okay, maybe if I stay here, I, can, I might be able to hit him a little and not get burnt so much. Maybe, probably not. Okay, everybody, are you fighting? Kind of. All right, I'm gonna stay on this side. They're gonna have to just deal with the other sides. I'd say the good part about using gigas is that they're tall. You can reach the creatures. Oh, hello, uh, enraged trike. Okay. Technically counts as an alpha, so I'm going to get a little bit of a boost on my chibi. Okay. Hello, wyvern. Oh my. You, what big wings you have. Can you like not do the flamey flame? Because I'm not really enjoying the flamey flame. Not really. Oh my God. That trike is, oh my God. Are you kidding me? That thing does so much damage. Holy crap. It does like a thousand per hit. That's not okay. Oh my God, no wonder, because there's another one. Okay, let's go in on that trike. Boys, come on. All right, all right, go in on the trike, come on. Let's go, let's go for that trike. Oh, come on, here you go. Go for the trike. Yeah, you do the work. I'm just gonna stay back here and watch. Okay, I like how that one there is just completely like sitting there. I don't know what he's doing. He's just chilling. Okay, one of them's dead, one of them's dead. Get the other one, for galley's sake, do it. Okay, there we go. Everybody in on this stupid trike because it's alpha boosting everything and that's the issue right now And as you can see my Rex right there is like super hurt Okay, this trike should be dead soon. I I hope <gasps> It's dead. Okay, we're good All right All right, let's see I'm gonna go over here and start dealing with some of these guys um, You guys just you know hang out hang out like you know go kill some things baby if you feel like it like, you know, you could just stand there too. Let's kill things. Are you kidding me? You're standing still. That's why you died. I'm glad that you died. Okay. We're good. We're, we're, I'm calm. Don't worry. Is this the last wave? I hope this is the last wave. Because I don't think we're going to be able to survive another one. Up with those corrupted trike thingies. I'm not. All right. Come on. I like the enraged trikes actually, and I like the enraged rexes. I only wish that there was more varieties in the alpha enraged creatures. You know, would have been cool. It's cool that we first got an alpha uh, herbivore in this um, DLC. You know, they actually announced a few years ago that in a few months, that's what they said, uh, we would have like alpha dire bears, you know? So that, that was cool. 
it's been years since they said that and they even said those words like in a few months but you know <laughs> i love it all right come on let's do our little dance here i know the drill okay just start whacking away maybe i can hit their wings as they flap down okay can we can we maybe kill some of these guys like what are you guys doing are you down there fighting relatops fantastic okay let's get uh let's get these guys down maybe hmm could be a great idea i feel like you guys really like to not get set on fire all the time okay that's not working there we go got it all right they're like doing nothing over there they can't even hit it we need to get them over here oh hello spino where are you coming from okay there we go oh this rex is totally gonna die during this one damn it okay here we go let's get everybody onto neutral okay no we gotta kill we gotta kill the enraged trike let's just everybody go for the trike let's just get everybody in on the stupid trike because if we don't kill this quick our guys are gonna die quicker okay everybody keep fighting there we go no no, no enraged trike come on keep fighting it i know you guys could do it there we go we took one down there's definitely another i just don't know where it is oh there it is it's like right in here it's like a whole big mess all right two are dead enraged trike's dead okay cool oh my god there's a lot of creatures back there all right i guess i'm gonna go back and start dealing with them because my guys are just busy with everything else you know what let's get everybody in here actually it might be better just to have them all fighting in the same place um okay yeah uh boys where are you huh no you're just all the way over there okay this is great this is going swimmingly we got we got like 5k health we're good we're good we might be okay Okay, let me start dealing with some of these guys. Oh my god, the wyverns are just the biggest pain. Okay. I got a little bit of time left before I am forced to pop off. I'm just gonna keep that up so you guys can see as well. If you can read it, it's like very small in the corner. Um, oh wow, okay. Oh, we gotta hop off. Ooh, I gotta get in there. Can they hurt him while he's in here? They can. Hmm. He's dead. And I'm on fire. I didn't think that could happen. I like how their fire can just go straight through here. Oh, I can shoot them as they put their faces through. That's cool. That actually could be useful. Just keep my head down so I can avoid the wyverns. That looked like it was probably going to hit me. Okay, so I'm starting to think that maybe... Oh, crap. Yeah, flare might be a better choice as a creature to ride on. Just because I can not get hurt by the wyvern breath. And I can also fly up and hit them. Let's also set everything on fire as we go here not the same kind of health pool as the uh rexes but you know i just feel like the giga would probably not do great anyway okay i feel like all the rexes have died as well i'm actually not sure about that one because i can't see any of them and i wasn't really paying attention okay so we've lost not that much health so far considering how many creatures are here it's mainly the wyverns that are hitting me to be honest they really don't like me. They see me and they're like, you're not corrupt enough. I've got to corrupt him. His innocent mind. Oh, man. All right. There we go. I did grab the saddle, by the way, from the Rex. You know what? I can do this, actually. I can move them away. <laughs> Let's start fighting away here. Hmm. 
I'm okay with this if this clone dies. It would be kind of annoying, but you know, they're replaceable. Just gotta kill all these stupid wyverns though. They were like the only thing I couldn't hit while putting, like, you know, shooting the shotgun. They weren't putting their faces through enough. I don't think they were able to, but you know. There we go, I killed one. I reckon some of the others are like low health. It's just, you can't see if they're bloody or not. So there we go, that's two. All right, let's uh, wait for some stab to come back here. All right, this should be the last wave anyway. Well, we've done it pretty much. <laughs> All right, wow, the stam is still not back enough. All right, we'll just pump in some food. So yeah, this is being kind of crazy. Obviously, if I took out more Rexes at the start, it would have probably helped a little. Um, definitely using a Gega could be good because, you know, these things fly a little high on, unless you got good weapons, which you can't really take out during it. So Wyverns versus or like weapons versus the wyverns isn't really a great idea. But um Yeah, definitely a, a Giga would be handy because you could reach them at least. Alright, I think it's just this thing right here. This little dimorph. Uh let's go ahead and try to take it out. Nope. Nope. It just doesn't even care about me. We got it! Nice. Alright, how much weight does my Giga have? Alright, well, you're gonna need to come in here, bud. Start getting through here. Apparently we can't. That's cool. I gotta break my, um, shield, or else it's just gonna explode. So, that's something we gotta do. Oh, yay. Sweet, the body left. Alright, so first of all, eject items. Secondly, we gotta demolish this. It's just going to break otherwise, so I kind of have to. All right, let's just drop everything and... Wait. Okay, we had that on. Sweet. Uh, let's just wait for everything to drop down first. Nice. Okay. This is a good way of actually seeing what we're getting as well. I'm going to take that, and I'm just going to check you real quick. Okay. So I'm just going to drop all that into you. Okay, wow. That's super heavy. Uh, oh my god, hello! Okay, okay, yeah, I'm digging that. I'm definitely digging that one. All right, we're just gonna have to do this. <laughs> oh, sweet. Yeah, it, the, the shield would have blown up right there. <laughs> oh my god, hello. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm enjoying some of this stuff, for sure. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm okay with all of this. Let's see. Um... Rexes probably have more weight a little bit more maybe let's pop you out Okay you Just grab All this <sighs> Seriously, you're not oh I can reach him. Okay, cool. There we go And grab that All right, so we actually got exactly what we're looking for look at that look at that look right there Somebody's gonna say I spawned it in somehow <laughs> Well, that would be kind of funny. Uh, let's see. All right. Well, yeah, I, th I think that's that's all the loot, right? I think that's all of the loot. I am completely okay with the with this lovely little Rex saddle right here. The saddle blueprint. I'm glad that I've been collecting all of my hide because we're going to need a lot for that. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. So, yeah, some, uh, some pretty good stuff. I mean, you know, the... It, it's, you know what? I'm going to hang on to that. I was about to say... Is it even worth bringing it all home? Yes, it is worth it. I'm just going to bring it all home. Because, <laughs> yeah, it, it makes sense. Uh, let me grab that hide, though. So, yeah, um, we've got some pretty amazing things. I got that lovely shotgun. I mean, it's pretty good. It's not the best shotgun I've ever had, but it's it's pretty darn good, all right. Uh, we got to make sure that we don't leave our stuff on the ground here as well, because that is me. And these are all the ingots from the uh, the drop. Okay. How am I supposed to bring all these home from here? Uh, we're going to have to... You know what? I should have brought the basilisk. Yes, I should be bringing the basilisk with me because it's got such a good weight. 
All right, so I'm gonna have to. Are you full? You're already full, aren't you? Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna have to like fly back for this. But um, yeah, guys, that is gonna be it for today. We uh we did a red drop. I'm pretty happy with the result. Unfortunately, we didn't get a mech, but that is okay. Um, because we did get all this other great stuff. Uh, I'm really happy with that wreck saddle for sure. Like that is that's so handy. It's exactly what we needed. And I'm extremely happy with it. The sniper is pretty good too. I'm actually, I'm probably going to end up using that a little bit for these drops because it's really handy to take out like Tyranodons and uh, Dimorphs with like headshots. Um, so yeah, I'll definitely be using that a little bit. Uh, so yeah, guys, that's going to be it for today. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit the like button. Oh God, you died. I'm so sorry. All the Rexes died. <laughs> um, yeah, if you want to see more like this, you can of course subscribe and uh, we'll be seeing you in the next one. Don't worry, I won't forget anything. <laughs>